What's up everyone? Today we're going to be hooking up a truck though directly from the uh, fifth wheel. I'll be using the uh, kingpin attachment. Let me show you how I set that up in here. So the first thing you want to do, you want to turn your receivers facing down in the inboard position and then uh, you're going to slide in your pentahook attachment just like this oh, bring that over a little bit yeah right there good next you want to attach the end cups we're going to be using these later on to chain up the axles let's put the other one there Let's lock up the uh, pen hook attachment here. Make sure you lock that up good, both sides. All that gotta go. Yeah, the pen hook can be in there, cause uh, when I try to put the uh, kingpin attachment, that's gonna be on my way. So we definitely gotta remove the pen hook. Anyways, uh, let's try it on so you can see what I'm talking about here. See, like I'm trying to line it up and it's not lining up with the hole because I got that pen hook in the back there. So let's take that off real quick. attachment again yeah buddy that's it let's lock it up Don't forget to lock it up there you have it just gotta lock up the uh, end caps here for now We are ready to hook up to the truck. Before you hook up to the truck, you have to dump the air, dump the air ride suspension. very good King Ping is ready to go in The king ping is locked in place. Let's double check here. Yeah, buddy, we all locked up and ready to go. Well, almost ready. We halfway there. Now we gotta sheen up the axles here. So just grab your chain. Just leave about 10 inches hanging on one side like that. This point on, you just want to bring the chain around both axles. Just 
go under the axles yet. Let's make sure we don't break anything under that. So pull that sheen as tight as you can and uh, hook it up to yourself just like that. Take the chain by there, hook it up to the other side of the chain. Once again, pull that sheen as tight as you can and then uh, hook up the uh, chain binder to it. Very good, so let's do the other side now. We'll do the same thing again. goes on the both axles, bring it back up and attach it to itself, just like that, and pull it tight, take your other binder, hook it up right there. So the king pin attachment is basically just to keep it center, keep the truck center. You are picking up the truck with the chains, not with the king pin attachment. Almost ready here. Now we just gotta secure the steering wheel. Before I do that, I'm going to just check the, uh, the front wheels, make sure they lined up correctly. Looking good. Now let's go inside the truck and just uh, strap up the steering wheel so it won't move. That's it. It's pretty tight there. Last step here, I think it's gonna be putting these mirrors in. All right, we're ready to roll here. Just gotta do the safety chains and uh, we out.